everybody and welcome to part one of Resident Evil 8 Village, or Resident Evil Village as it's normally known. We're here on the PlayStation 4 version of the game. Me and Hardcore don't get on, so I'm going to play standard and we're going to dive right into this. Of course, if you're excited for this series, then do, of course, do all that uh, YouTube style things. And you know what? You know what? I feel like this is probably worthy of the face cam, which I'll turn on in just a moment. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a clip of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. What a weird way to start a Resident Evil game. Gain, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She that is one there. chubby baby. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. The woman at the store said it was traditional. Is that me? A local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. <laughs> You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Yeah, I wouldn't Can apologize for that, mate. Go cautiously with your daughter to bed. Wow, I'm detecting high levels of sass smear. I'll finish dinner. Hey, baby girl. My Mia's changed a lot. I'm guessing that's Mia. Where are my subtitles? I'm sure I put subtitles on. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember you. Uh, I can't boom. There we go. Leave it there for now. Let's, um... Alright, so the basics. Something? Nothing. I'll put her down. Okay, so nice little... Nice little house we got going on here. What was that? Examine. Baby, oh, the baby wipes. I couldn't quite see over my basically chunk of a baby. Look at that. She's very adorable. Mia has... Mia has changed a lot. Like, obviously, uh, I, I mean, I don't know how long after the... After the um, events of Seven this is. But this is a nice little house. Very nice. Mia's changed a lot. She's probably uh, feeling. Oh, I'm guessing the baby doesn't sleep in the in in in, in the pantry. Um, 
fairly amusing if it did. If she did. She, 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 not it, not it. Don't say it. Um. Alright, everything seems quite nice. A nice little strudel, a nice little pram, as we call them in this country. Once things warm up, we can go for a walk. <gasps> we can go for a walk, and there's a... Alright, I'm guessing the baby's room's upstairs, but I just want to explore everything. This oh, I'm, so, I'm so excited for this. I recently played through Resident Evil 7 again. Uh, over on twitch.tv forward slash corner of the internet. And oh, it's it's good. And I'm, I'm looking forward to kind of where this is going. I play. Shut your ear, be aberrant. I'm talking to my friends. Oh, very, very comforting. Like Ethan. Very comforting. Too scary for you. <laughs> anyway, so. I'm very much looking forward to this. I've played the demos. I've played the castle demo, the village demo. I've seen all the trailers. But apart from that, I know nothing about what happens. Nothing. Oh, it's one of them things. It someday. It's one of them things. <laughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. This is a huge house. This is a massive house. Like, so I'm guessing them they, they don't live. In the, they clearly don't live in the Baker's farm. Can you imagine? They suddenly go back to living on the Baker's farm. Just, it's like, oh, this is it's quite a nice place actually. Now you've done it up. Oh, this isn't your room. You know, you would have thought I'd know where the baby's room was, but uh, I don't actually live here, so. Almost there, honey. Okay, thank you. What's, what's the picture? Some flowers. But I reckon that, oh, here we are. I reckon that um, story at the beginning is probably important. Somehow. Rose is closed for tomorrow. It's very organized. It's very organized. Always best to be organized. Computer. Uh, Mia and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago. So it's three years after uh, she blew up. And that's obviously it's just three years after the events of Resident Evil 7. All right. That's good. We find ourselves down in New York in Europe and can bring up Rose properly. But I still feel part of me is trapped in that hell back in Louisiana. So, wow, they just left it <laughs> like sod America. I'm out. I know Mia doesn't like talking about it, but we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen. Something... We sh shouldn't we face what happened there so we can. I don't know why I'm sure to read it. Um, yeah, so we can show our lives with Rose without ha hanging over our heads. We are that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have explored a lot if in the hospital if she didn't care. Hey, babes. Uh, nice teddy bear. Back off like a light gun survivalist. The heavy firearms going for feet. They really ought to get you. So is Ethan a training? <laughs> oh, there it is. We still don't can't see Ethan's face. We still can't see Ethan's face. Nice sonogram pictures. They're not all oh, man. And there's Rose being born, hanging out. I as wish a... I could stay like this forever. Is there any more pages that way? It's like a picture of Evelyn or something. Alright. Cool. That's nice. Suitably explored. Let's put Rose down for her nappy naps. She's scary while she's angry. Yeah. You should see when she's really angry. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those breed fairy tale monsters get you. So the fairy tale ones. I wonder how, because um, if the demos are to be believed, which I have no reason to believe why they wouldn't be, the um, what you that, that's a freaking wall. The um, what you call it? Bros gets kidnapped and taken to the castle. So, I wonder how far in that happens. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. I want to look out the window. Let's look out the window. Oh, excuse me. What's that? Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Give me a second. Okay, we back. Uh, where were we? I feel like I was trying to explain something, but I'm also not that aware if I was. 
It's the sound, sound working. So it's just very quiet. Let's just double check. There we go. Okay, let's uh, head back downstairs for what is hopefully going to be a romantic evening. Hello, Mia. Time to get it on. Let's make another kid. Even though I don't really like him as a character. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. The. Mm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. It's chorba de la gum. I bet that's warm. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Local wine too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening. Maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. I mean, <laughs> in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, the military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, also, Ethan has had training. Better. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be. Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... <gasps> Mia, get down. Mia! Well, that was sudden. Oh, God. Chris? What the hell? This is happening. <gasps> no! <laughs> that was nervous laughter. Why? Okay, whoa. Whoa. Go move. All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. So, is Mia still? Why would why would they do that? Like she's a pin in the ass, but I mean, that was that that was brutal. Hey Doc. No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. So they're obviously worried that there'd be some traces of the um, fungi or whatever it was in the in a, in, in, in part seven. Maybe a trace of it left in Mia. The infection. It's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just Mia. What are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Yeah, bad call, Ethan. You shouldn't have you shouldn't have answered the phone. Oh, my little angel. Wow. So I I wonder if why would why would Chris do that? Like because that that's a murder. This, this this unless this is one elaborate plan from Mia. That that's definitely she's definitely dead. Nobody survives them bullets. A Chris Redfield never misses. But why didn't they kill Ethan? Why did they take Rose? And is it some? Is was Mia still affected? So they're taking Rose to treat her or something? Or 
Jesus. What if the people in the castle have got Claire Redfield, Chris's sister? Also my favourite Resident Evil character. Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not part of the portal. Fuck. Okay. What the hell happened to you? How the hell did we get here? Like... Oh, so we were obviously driving. The driver... Lost control. Mission object: eliminate target, recover body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Move the two Winters, Winterses to Site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. So, eliminate target. Mia was the target. Recover the body. So they have Mia's body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. We we weren't meant to die. They were never going to kill us. Just Mia. But why Miller? Why Mia? Was she still infected? So obviously we, we, we crashed, obviously. But where, where were we heading? Where was Site, site C? Um, where was Site C? Oh, this is, this is crazy. This is crazy. So did we, did we come from this way? I'll tell you what, Ethan's looking hentsher than he was in Resi 7. Did we, did we come from this way? Or... Oh, then there is tire tracks. Man, this would be so much more scary if I was, wasn't playing it in the middle of the day. <laughs> but needs must. <laughs> I've been so excited for this for so long. Like... For so long. Am I going the right way? It looks like it. It looks like it. Do not enter. Alright, so we've got crouch. Sorry, I'm entering. <laughs> I'm in Wait, he, did, he didn't have any staples on his hand anymore. Did he get a hand transplant? So we're going to stand up. So I'm guessing this is going to lead us to... The village, perhaps? Like one thing that Resident Evil do so well is the ambience and the sound and how crap this torch is. Dead bird. That, um... That bodes well. That bodes well. Oh, oh God! That's someone hung. What is? It's a the bird's been hung. What the fuck? Oh, that one just brushed past his head as well. It's like just letting it slide along his head. Oh my God! Whoa, she that kind of spawned out. I know he just headbutted that one. Nice try. Nice try. Nice try. Nice try. What the hell is killing bird? Like, I suppose it's not. The question isn't who's killing the birds. It's who the hell's hanging them, and are they the same person? I hope not. I just want to kind of try and explore as much as possible. Obviously, I'm never going to find everything on my first playthrough. But the more I can find, the, the, the better. If, if that makes sense. Ethan Winters. So many unanswered questions. Alright, this is looking more promising. I mean, just... Just walking through here takes some cojones. Like, do you not think did did one the guard not like have a gun or anything? 
all. Is this just a wood pile? Oh, it's a full house. It's so difficult to see. I love it. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Nothing. Alright, I like to leave... Was that, was that me or someone else, or was it just a floorboard? Oh my Christ. Okay, that could have been me. What's... Hello? How sinister that image looks. Okay, I can't see freaking anything over there. Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Oh no 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 no! All right, so we're going to explore in there in a second. Let's just make sure. Okay, so let's try to tap us. What you do when you're sneaking around a place? There's a toothbrush here. Nice looking boots would probably be quite good for outside. Okay. So we got small bed, table. What was through here? Just a while. I'm going to stick fairly close to the wall. Oh, there's a lantern there. Basement. That always ends well. Go into the basement. That's exactly what you should do in a horror film. This is horrible. <laughs> this is horrible. I think I saw... Um, what the hell? Oh, is that that... Um, what did they call her in the in the village demo? This idiot. Jesus. Um, what did they call her in the um, Lady Cassandra? Is that what she's called? Ethan, what are we doing, man? Mm, there's blood on the cupboard. Just a rat. Turn around, anyone there? Oh, I was expecting to turn around and um, there'd be someone there. All right, well, this house looks in good condition. In great condition, some would say. Cool. Well, I want to go back upstairs now. What's that? I don't even know what that is. All right, so it sounds like um, someone's home. That's garlic. That's freaking garlic. What? It Someone's gonna jump scare me. Lovely. It's just paint, Ethan. Tell yourself it's just paint. It's just paint. It's just paint. What the frick? So any clues of what did this? No, 
Okay. Wow. So we, it looks like we had to go in that house, really. I mean, werewolf, maybe. Oh my God. The atmosphere in this game is in it. Like, if they redid Resi 7 to look like that in, a, in the the guest house where you first arrive, bloody hell. I mean, and Resident Evil 7's aged well. It looks, it looks decent. When did it come out? 2017? I think it came out. So it's it's aged pretty well. Where the hell am I? And there's the village and holy crap, it looks like a freaking scene from Dracula. I love it. I love it. I love it, 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 I love it. Okay, here we are in the village with a dead horse. You know, some people say in my, uh, <laughs> I, was, I don't know. Some people say in my videos are like that, flogging a dead horse because it's not gonna, <laughs> it doesn't matter. Shh. There's a, there's a joke there somewhere. I'm not sure what the joke is, but never mind. Uh, okay. Okay. Mm. More garlic. Split eggs. So something's happened in. In a hurry. Maybe maybe they're out. Maybe they're out. But that's the sign. That's the symbol again. That symbol. That's the second time we've seen that. And that's our picture. I think she was called Lady Cassandra. Not the big boobed lady. The uh, big nostril lady. The an easy pick lock. Hmm. Hello. What's that? It's like somebody has stopped pigs. Let's just keep walking around this way. Alright, we can't get that. Let's see what's through the doors at the bottom. That's way. Um. Alright, it looks like it loops around. Like, this place is horrific. Like, some, some crap's gone down here. To kill... I thought there was a dead sheep then, but it's not. But it's not. So that was the old house with the... I want to see what's in the courtyard area that was behind the house. That I didn't actually go through the door to see. A uh, gate. It's like town entrance, maybe. Uh, so is that the back of the house? That is the back of the house, so... Through there was the house, right? Yeah. Okay, what have we got? Just need some sort of other item so we can winch up the well. I'll winch down the well. More blood. Handcuffs. Some sort of prison holding facility for the full moon, maybe? Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, this game's going to let me wander for a long time. I can guarantee it's just going to lull you in to a small sense of security. Do that in there. With a padlock on. So I wonder if we're either going to be let in there or we need to find some sort of key. There's an easy to pick, lo easy to pick lock. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Wait, that's that's still red. That, does, that means there's an item in there. Or there might be an item in there. But I can't see any item. Oh, it might be the bird cage. So there is another there is another floor, but there's no items on the ground floor that I can there's no items I can get at the moment. That's good. That's good. Gotta keep your eyes open. Gotta keep our eyes open. What's this? Can we get through here? No. No we cannot. Wow, look at that's a big amount of storage. 
Uh, I had a quick look at the trophies for this. I didn't look at the hidden trophies, like for story spoilers or anything, but the trophies are pretty standard from what you'd expect a um, Resident Evil game to have in terms of platinum trophies. So, multiple difficulties, etc, etc, etc. This looks like it might be a dead end again. Just trying to fill in the map a little bit. Portaloo, let's go for a piss. Someone's obviously in there. Never mind, I'll come back. Got hiccups. Ba -da -da -da. It's obviously pulled by a horse at one point or other. More hanging. So are the hanging... Are the hanging crows to ward off... Werewolves? Or... A workshop, ceremony site, graveyard. Okay. Is that a person? No, it's not. So the game's kind of guiding me where it wants to go. Where it wants me to go. Dictating which way I can go. Which is good. I like a slightly linear game. Locked due to missing home owner. Okay. Locked due to missing home owner. Well, it's like quite a big area behind there as well. Like, a pretty... There's a couple of houses in there, at least. So, always buy your house in a shed. Or, um, yeah, shed, barn. A barn's a bigger shed, but you get the idea. Um, so, it looks like our only option is to go in here. Excellent. Which looks a little bit more homely. Some force could break it. Okay, so we've got block. But look who's left. Oh, there's a knife. So I said, medicare. Oh wow, they took up two of these. Oh, I'm not just kidding. No, am I, am I kidding? No, we're good. Oh, you can yawn, no, apparently. Ew. You don't want to eat it, would you? But it all looks abandoned, doesn't it? We've seen that picture before. With the... Woman knitting like that. Frickin' hell. Friendly. <sighs> Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road. And... What's going on? I... Oh, no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! Take it! Oh, we got it. Hey, are you listening? Oh. A dead body? Where did his shotgun go? <laughs> Where did his shotgun go? Oh my god. What a... Wow, well there's the villagers. 
selbst kümmern, finde ich Sand. Jesus Christ. Where did this shotgun go? That's not the point here, but where the, where the freaking hell is he shot him? That's, that's my, that's my good hand. Oh, he has no luck with that left hand. Did he bite his fingers off? Oh my god, he's just a good chunk out of it. He has no luck with that hand. Okay, that went well. Oh, I cut him for crap. Got him for crap. Oh, dear Lord. Oh, God. What the hell? Did it want me to use all my bullets? Okay. That was, uh... Fa <gasps> oh, it's weird. That's our family photo. I thought we found a family photo there. <laughs> okay, I have no bullets now. That bothers me a little bit. Let's run in here, like. Bulkers. Also key items are in a different place. So the bulk cutters aren't gonna take up any infantry room. That's cool. I've got crafting as well. So we're going to find different bits. That's that's awesome. And I'm guessing now we can unlock the uh, different area. Was this the... Hmm. Let's just have a... So there's some more chem fluid there. That's good. Let's just have a look around. A herb. So do you combine the herb and the chem fluid? Become first aid spray. Uh, first aid med stuff. That's good. Try and remember that. I would like some. Oh, I got a trophy. Crafter. Crafter. Guess I'm asked for crafting an item. <laughs> Spoilers. But we're in it now. I have a trophy. Okay. So, bolt cutters. There we go. So, that was... There, there's another lock there. Let's just have a little explore of these houses. I don't know what that was, but I'm not scared. Even though I don't have any bullets. Ammo. All right, there is definitely something here. There is definitely. Something. Oh, we can barricade doors now. Freaking hell! What have we been eating? Can fluid.
So this um, this town appears to be infested with werewolves. So uh, I'm not gonna lie, a little bit afraid. It's a warning shot, bitch. I am literally surrounded. I've got to remember to guard. I've got to remember to guard. I regret coming in here now. i got to remember to guard. I can't, I can't keep getting eaten like this. God, I've got three bullets and there's like... Is it over? No, there's still one behind us. But it seems to have gone. Okay, let's um... If there are any survivors out there, come to my... To Louisa's house near the field. Survivors? Freaking look at the hand, man. What you, his left hand is not very lucky. What was that punk that was behind? Because I'm guessing Louise's house is. I can't, I want to explore everything, man. I want to explore everything. My God. The herb. Which is good because now I can make another chem fluid. Okay. Oh, I got a shotgun. Survive the attack. What? What attack? Alright, save the shotgun because I've only got two bullets. Gunpowder. Can I craft bullets? Nope. Alright. Punk. Eat shotgun, asshole. Oh, shit. There's no end to them. I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to kill one with my knife. I should have closed the door, but I'm really dumb. And I'm probably gonna die, gonna die. I'm probably gonna die, gonna die. I'm probably gonna die, gonna die. Let's go down here and... Where's the scrap? I can craft ammo. I can craft that as well. I'm probably gonna die, gonna die. I'm probably gonna die, gonna die. I'm gonna die. And everyone's gonna laugh. I'm gonna run away, run away. No, get the freaking ammo, get the ammo, get the ammo! I need that gun ammo, ammo, I need the ammo. Let 
No, no you don't, punk. What the hell is going on? Alright, I need to use my health spray. Health goop. Full of gunpowder, eh? Reload that. So unless I'm a really bad shot, I can kill in one shot with the shotgun. Herb, which means I can make some more health. Oh my god, this is tense. Okay, I'm a really bad shot. Oh, Ethan, you gotta shoot, man. Stand there looking at him. Put some so called hard cash. Climb the ladder. Keep climbing. <laughs> oh my god. What the frick? Whoa! I didn't even see him. I didn't see him. I didn't see him. I didn't see him. I didn't see him. Sit down, you bitch. Oh, I didn't see him either. I'm gonna die. 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 I need to start being more aware of my surroundings. I don't know where I'm going. Wait, I have, I have, I have health. I have health. I have health. Shit. Uh, that's a big guy. That's a big guy. That's a big guy. You're a bitch. I'm gonna die. They have horses. <laughs> Alright. There are times in life where you don't need to panic. This is one where you need to panic. Okay. Arrow in the leg. Two fingers missing <laughs> on my left hand. <laughs> like, this guy gets fudged up, man. Uh, early game prediction, I do think Ethan dies in this game. It's like his last hurrah. Three fingers left. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait, oh my god! Not liking this. Oh, that's a good one. Don't like that. That's that's clever. That actually, not liking this. I like that. Got some cash. It's locked. Damn it! So that house is locked, and it'll tell me it's locked, right? Um, okay, well, it looks like the only thing we can do is follow the old crazy lady from the demo. Yeah. In life and in death, you give glory. Uh, hello? Mother Miranda, that's who it's not. Be out here. It's not safe. Mother Miranda, I don't know what I said earlier, but it's Mother Miranda. Hey, can you hear me? The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. This is a demo. She's in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. 
What are you talking about? The monsters? Castle Bell heralds danger. They're coming. <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell toll for us all. They're coming again. <laughs> Rose is here? Every game needs a crazy old lady in it. Look for Rose. So this legit is the demo now. So I wonder, I wonder if it plays the same. But I like now I know this crafting and stuff. I'm exploring everything. Um, I'm gonna try and find everything. Easy to pick lock. Another one that's good. This mark on the map. My God. What a, what a welcome party. <laughs> what a welcome party. Okay, let's have a, let's have a gander around. You know what, actually, you know what? Now I'm thinking about it. This. Mm. Mm. You know what, yeah. This is probably a good place to leave the first episode. I think we've achieved... It got a mount. We started, we got into the length of the game and stuff. So I'm going to thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next episode, hopefully. Bye.